Now who doesn't like cheeseburgers? Crazy people. Like Samuel L. Jackson says. Hamburgers! The cornerstone of any nutritious breakfast. You got your meat, onions, lettuce, tomato, cheese, 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 bread. Just tell me a more rounded meal. It's fucking fantastic. Then there's sushi. Delicious sushi. Fish, omega-3. Rice, nigiri. Maki, futamaki. Temaki. Lots of other different sushi styles. So since I'm doing crazy ass fusion things here on this channel, I was thinking how, how can I combine hamburgers, something as iconic as hamburgers, with something as iconic as sushi. So I decided to roll up a hamburger, futomaki style, and I would like to call it Hambushi TM. Now to make the Hambushi at home, this is what I did. I don't have an oven since I live in Japan and we only have those small like a fish tray ovens. I can't bake bread in that, so I got the next best thing. I got some brioche bread, which I rolled out with a rolling pin. And then I fried it in butter. So it's going to, you know, stick together. And like any regular burger, you're gonna need your vegetables. Lettuce. Tomato. And some onions. Finely chopped. Tia. And that's it, unless cheese is a vegetable for you. Don't worry, we're getting to the cheese. Calm down. Then it's time for the meat. I uh, stupidly uh, used a 50-50 blend of pork and beef. Remember to salt and pepper both sides. I only did one. Oopsie. Then it's time for assembly. You need to throw everything on top of the toasted brioche for toasts thing. Then remember that you should have probably made a bigger patty because it shrunk like hell. But I have a solution for it. Improvise, adapt, overcome. Thanks, Bear Grylls! <laughs> now, after laying down the cheese, it's time to roll this bad boy up. While rolling I could already feel like it was going to be like a tight fit because I overfilled it. And also the slices of toast were kind of splitting apart, fucking up my whole the whole hambushi. What can I do? Yeah. Actually I should have probably fried it in the pan after rolling it up. Then I tried to slice it, and the thing burst open like a fucking Christmas sausage. But you know what? That's okay. This isn't television. This is real life. Sometimes shit doesn't work out. I eventually removed the shitty pieces and tried to uh, make it look perfect, just like they do on television, for my Instagram. Follow me on Instagram. I gotta admit, it was pretty good. It was 
sweet and savory and delicious and tasted like burger. So that's it. Thank you for watching me make and fail at making a hambushi. I gotta tell you, it was delicious though, and while I'm stuffing my face with it in the background here, why don't you just go ahead and uh, subscribe to my channel already? Please, subscribe. Come on, man. Come on.